social media is is Ugh. a that's like a, a terrible huge oh. part yeah of it. it's a huge part and it is I, a huge part it's of it. very impactful and i've like stayed away from it i don't like going on social media as much because like especially for me because i'm working on like self-love and like Who loving myself she's a good one <laughs> like loving myself seeing <laughs> Seeing different people that are like, oh, I wish I looked like that. Then mm. I'm like, I don't look like that. I don't love myself. I wish I looked like that. It right. doesn't help build. It like mm -mm. breaks it down and it's not like it's not a good thing. And people see these things that like happen and stuff. And then it's just it's just very like negative. And all of the negativity on social media is very like impactful in your life that people don't realize mm -hmm. that well and you and I talked about mm -hmm. that all of these Instagram filters and Snapchat filters oh. yeah. and all of that that you know she had a profound thing to say about about that and if you want to share it I would love for you to people like have like when you guys when you were a kid before well when I was a kid before like Snapchat filters were around mm -hmm. you'd take a photo and it would just be you you'd be yes. fine with it as soon as all these filters came on, we would hide our oh. face and it would change all this stuff. Mm. And then you'd only like yourself with that filter on. Oh. And then you wouldn't, then seeing yourself in like the mirror, you'd be like, I don't look good. And you only take photos with filters. And then you like, aren't actually loving yourself. Right. Same with makeup, but it's like, it depends on what. If yes. you can love yourself without makeup and without anything on, that is like, that's what mm -hmm. we need. But if you need to have makeup on where you can't do anything without it. Right. That's not self-love. That's you have to be comfortable you in your right. own skin, not something covering it. You're right.